You can either divide the numbers turn by turn, or we can use divisibility rules. I mean, every number is divisible by one, so this is okay. This is an even number on top, so it's got to be divisible by two. The digit sum of this is two plus zero plus one plus three, which is six. That wouldn't necessarily be divisible by three. Okay, you can check it if you want. And E ends in a five top number, so it's got to be divisible by five. That means it must be D. Actually, for a number to be divisible by four, you just have to look at the last two digits and see if they are divisible by four. And 14 is not. So, whereas, you know, you can take, you could take a really big number and I could make it like, I don't know, 28 at the end. And this is necessarily divisible by four. Um, the reason being that I could write it as this plus 28. And this part is necessarily divisible by four because it's a multiple of 100. Okay, so it doesn't matter about anything beyond the tens column. All, all of this will be divisible by four. So that's why it's just the last two digits.